Right on. So what is it we're doing again? This is a fizzy test. We are testing parameters, military parameters of 0.07 to 0.20% of uh, the icy fuel mixture compared to plain fuel. Uh, we're testing products named as the Pris, Digme, any icy fuel additive, all the same stuff. Uh, the brand name that we use is Dice 190. But uh, I'm going to take empty cup right here, and I'm going to put 80 milliliters of fuel with pressed, exactly 80 milliliters, And your name is once again? Craig Robichaud. And you're with? Landmark Aviation, site trainer, 17 years last experience. Gotta be exactly that, so sometimes it takes, it takes a little while to get exactly there because you're talking milliliters. All right. Exactly, 80 milliliters. All right, I'm going to take my beaker right here. Notice it's nice, clean, and dry. I'm going to pour the mix of fuel and any icing fuel additive in here. I'm going to draw one milliliter of water. It's really, really nice of you to let me... Uh... Oh, no problem, man. <clears throat> so, one milliliter of water. What's going to happen is, the additive is going to actually attach to the water, and that's what we're going to end up testing. Shake this for five minutes, vigorously. You got a stopwatch, dude? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Actually, I do. It's right here on my phone. So you started out at 42. Okay, cool. All right. From one end to the other, we switch. Um, one minute's a long oh, time to shake, too, isn't it? No, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, the old way, the old way was 160 gallons of mix and two milliliters of water, but you're still testing the same ratio of uh, mixture to water. You got 26 seconds left. All right. See how many more times you can switch hands. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I right, ten seconds. All right. Now remember, we're doing five minutes now. I think you're going to let it settle for a full five minutes. All right. Now you can see this is a little time consuming. We're going to shake it for five minutes. We're going to set it in the beaker, and we're going to go ahead and let it set for five minutes, and then we're going to test the sample. Uh, you're going to see the actual separation of the additive attached to water that's going to be uh, If you want, you can actually film close to the beaker. All right. Okay, we're finished our shaking, and you can tell that the fuel that's attached to the press is actually selling on the bottom. You can see it's starting to build up. Yep. That's great. That's what it's supposed to do. And we're going to wait our five minutes, and then we're going to go ahead and test that sample. All right, so we'll come back in five. Yes, sir. Yep. Yes, sir. So that's it. We're, we're good. We're within spec. Yes, sir. Uh, clean it in case the next guy comes through and don't do a, such a thorough job as cleaning that. Yep, that's correct. <laughs> the uh, Skymark truck passed. Yep. Right on. Thank you once again for the uh, training video. Training video, yes, sir. All right, this is the sample. After it has uh, settled for a full five minutes, we're going to go ahead and take about six or seven drops, and we're going to put it in our refractor. Open it very slowly. All right. We're going to take this little sample. We're going to put it in the refractor. 
close our lid and look in good sunlight and see where that is. All right, I am at 0 0.9, 0 0.09, 0 0.09. So we're within <coughs> 0 0.07 and 0 0.20 as per military specs. So that's good stuff. Yes, sir. Beautiful. Yeah, yeah. You can you can pause it there. All right. All right. This is the refractor that you're actually going to test the fuel with. As you can see, you're going to drop the sample down this little area right here. You need to be sure that it's clean. What I'm going to do is I'm going to get some water and I'm going to clean it and dry it just to be sure that there's no contaminants from the previous test. If you don't do this, your test is going to be erroneous because you're going to still have some fuel from the last sample. So clean this real good. All right. Our sample settling. Whenever we get that, we're going to go ahead and put that on here and we're going to look at the results. All right. Still waiting to set. Settling nicely. And we're going to stop now? Yes, sir. Yep. Yes, sir. So that's it. We're, we're good. We're within spec. Yes, sir. Clean it in case the next guy comes through and don't do a, such a thorough job as cleaning that. Yep, that's correct. <laughs> the uh, Skymark truck passed. Yep. Right on. Thank you once again for the uh, training video. Training video, yes, sir.